Think about it. Cuba owned by a disorganized parliament over 4,000 miles away. Cubans were in a constant... Cubans were in a constant state of revolt. In 1904, the United States decided to throw a little weight around and, uh... Who is it? Mr. Pizza Guy. Again? Mr. Pizza Guy, sir. <laughs> Who ordered the double cheese and sausage? Right here, dude. <laughs> Hallucinating here. Just what in the hell do you think you're doing? Learning about Cuba, having some food. Mr. Spicoli, you're on dangerous ground here. You're causing a major disturbance on my time. <laughs> I've been thinking about this, Mr. Han. If I'm here and you're here, doesn't that make it our time? And certainly there's nothing wrong with a little feast on our time. You're absolutely right, Mr. Spicoli. It is our time. Yours, mine, and everyone else's in this room. But it is my class. Hamilton, Brandt, Kornfeld, up front. Mr. Spicoli has been kind enough to bring us a snack. Be my guest. Help yourselves. Get a good one. <laughs> <laughs> 